So I want to show you a um, couple of muscle powered devices here to charge um, electricity or make turn human or, or energy from the food into electricity. So um, two of those are commercial devices and one is a self-built one. Um, this is the first commercial. It's an now light. You just pull on the string and it's about I don't know, 45 minutes of pulling to charge a smartphone, maybe half an hour or so. It's relatively easy and I place it here on the door because it's a strong attachment point and also I can look out of the window. Um, there are a couple of lights. You can, first of all, you can plug a USB chargeable device here. Uh, this is the solar power input and um, you can see it can be quite bright. So um, switching it off, it shows the percentage how full it is. And then there goes a cable up here to a kind of, it's called a satellite light. Um, it's quite a bright thing also. Um, yeah, so that's a really nice device, the now light. There's a couple of little issues um, is that I think when this was in the box transported, some of these plastic strips, interchangeable plastic strips have been bent and uh, that way probably have been broken quite easily. So I think that's a bit of a weak point, um, but I'm in very, very good, very nice, very helpful dialogue with the manufacturer Desivat. And they have already like uh, come up with a new material to make them and they are sending some replacements. So that's on the way, good. Only issue here is, I mean, like that's basically the same with any of these devices, is that if it's if the battery itself is minus degrees and here the door is the coolest place, um, then it's not uh, happy to not possible to charge the battery. Yeah. So then um, the next device here is this one, also a commercial device. Uh, it's called Free Play Free Charge. Um, has a 12 volt socket here and um, you charge it like use it like this yeah it works not the nicest in a way um, good it's you know it's really robust fits in the pocket and you can charge the device with it it's really slow so um, if the free play people are watching what would be nice is having a nice possibility to strap this somewhere and then replace this, have some, you know, replacements to replace this handle with something else, uh, like a wheel or something that you can maybe put it with cordage or run it, run a belt over it, attach it to a bicycle, whatever, like make it a bit more universal versatile. Um, yeah, then the next device that's like not commercial, um, they're going to show it to you soon. This is the setup. It's um, you know one of these exercise bikes stripped of the plastic. Um, I had calculated the ratios, like if I turn this 60 rounds per minute, these ones, how many times this one was, and and um, yeah, then I bought this scooter motor. Uh, it says 24 volt DC, rated speed 2,700 RPM. 2.5 uh, ampere and 180 watt um, so this is just you know you see here screwed to the board the board I just strapped with some knots to the leg uh, it's quite a secure connection and then have this string here running up to the handle and um, to tension gonna show this is the Blake knot, you know, it's a sliding knot, so now it's loose, and now I just tension it, and it doesn't need much tension to see. Have this roll on here. This is this um, kind of, you know, it's a foot that you can put under generators or something or motors engines to um, to buffer the vibrations. So, yeah, and it has a eight uh, M eight thread in it. Uh, it runs really nicely, like, you know, this made a groove 
no it doesn't go any deeper it's just running on here and um i don't know go and pedal on it you see down there there are two power banks like this one there so and with very little like it's almost too easy to pedal like i would wish some more resistance um you know, these usb devices they only can take so much energy so even if i'm able to create a lot more they just have are limited in the input um so basically now what i need to get is more sockets so that it can just plug in more devices and charge more devices at the same time um like with this it's same speed as a normal you know socket outlet wall charger so that's the speed that it takes so even if i pedal harder it won't charge it any faster so um yeah for sure like much easier than the now light um yeah it was cheaper than the now light all the parts here are second hand uh minus this uh roller that was on the you know that i installed to the motor um and yeah as a little maybe a little bonus show you a very useful knot this is the blake knot blake hitch um go over to animatednots.org the knot is in there it's a very useful knot for you know um tensioning top lines or also for um you know like instead of a rubber band you can just put this muesli package and it stays closed so you can open it like it's like a like a cable tie basically not sliding they can just slide it closed and it doesn't open but i can open it under tension so if it's now under tension and i move the knot it slides open so yeah really nice knot i use it a lot um you know for packages like this um it's another package like just boom closed um yeah and also here very adjustable nice knot um good stuff that was it for now have a good time um please put questions in the comments down below subscribe share um and yeah and a few i mean these are really easy to build like i mean really this is like no black magic to it i you know it's just coming out of here and there's just one fuse and then there's the 12 volt socket here uh, where i have this usb port and um like the voltage that we got here is like you know it, it like very easily over 12 volt but uh this part here it somehow you know makes sure that the output is 5 volt it can accept the input between 12 and 24 volt it also of course takes a lower input than 12 volt and so yeah very happy with this so far probably um yeah i could do something better if something is wrong or so if you think like yeah there's like room for improvement um also those comments are very welcome that's it have a good time bye bye